every single day this one message comes on my chat what if i fail again man and this message has come from a dropper why because they have seen the reality they have seen the reality of failure and every single time they think of may 3 that is the first thought that comes to their head ma'am what if i fail again so under fear continue i they don't prepare really well and i know if you're watching this video you might be one among them why you clicked on this video because you also have that fear what if i fail again many of you at the night wake up between your sleep and think that oh my god neat exam is tomorrow and i have not prepared because you are just reliving the same day that happened last year or last last year some of you might be in their first drop some of you might be in the second drop third drop and i know it is not easy because every single day people put their expectation knowingly or unknowingly on you asking that you will become doctor right next year you are going to be doctor right oh he is going to be a doctor everyone will talk this conversation and every single time you hear this some might think that it is a motivation but for a dropper it is a fear of failing again so students in this video i am going to help you tell you exactly what you are supposed to do from today forget about whatever happened i know it is not easy to forget the fear or the guilt adu vandu permanent aata irukum but ana from today onwards i am going to tell you how you are supposed to change because what if i fail again is just a question and overthinking through that will not let you complete the syllabus because you have so many things to prove to so many people but keeping all of that aside you have to prove to yourself that you are a better version of what you are you have changed from last year that is very important because students every year wonder you have to be the better version of yourself and for every student who have taken a drop year let me tell you one thing very clearly what you learn in a drop year no other years in your life be it your years in mbbs be it your years in any degree cannot give you because the amount of patience consistency discipline failure depression overthinking everything that you went through in that drop year is going to make you a stronger person and you will be able to face many things in life because of that so you know after failing you still decided that okay i am going to take another drop or i am going to do it again that itself shows the amount of courage that you hold so now forget about motivation forget about discipline forget about consistency for yourself let this be the last video that you're watching and let this be the last question you're asking yourself what if i fail again because it's not about failure students it's about what you learned this year how much you improved from last year if you're still not doing your best let me tell you let this be a warning call for all of you who are watching this video i am giving you an alarm that it is almost time let's not overthink let's not go into the guilt loop instead let's start from today and make a better version of ourselves in the coming four months so now first of all let's start with what we are supposed to do all of you know that neat one the complete ana syllabus completion romba mukhyamana oru vishayam because neat ile syllabus if you have not completed then students whatever you do you do part test you do full test you do pyqs you attend every day life adu vand utilize agada and also it is useless so adinale syllabus vand complete pannam and you have to do at least Three rounds of revision. Three rounds of revision. But now more than 15 mock tests you have to give because you are a dropper student. At least you have to dedicate nine to ten hours. Many people are dedicating 14 hours, 16 hours. But that one the romba you know extreme situation. But Anna, ten hours minimum. Ilana nine hours minimum. Ipo syllabus completion. One the January or February max to max. Konjo backlogs. One the February you can complete. Ilana. jan kula you should complete the entire syllabus now syllabus completion kan appuram ena pananum see after you complete the syllabus you would have gone through syllabus neither by one shot or you would have finished one shot after that red ncert after you complete the syllabus i want you to do a one round full syllabus revision with the help of ncert ma'am epdi ma'am you have to read ncert or you have to go through something called as ncert highlights okay இது மாதிரி என்சிஆர்டி ஹைலைட்ஸ் பார்க்கும் போது என்சிஆர்டியில் இருக்கிற எல்லா லைனுமே ஆட்டோமேட்டிக்லி வில் பி ரீகால்ட் இன் யோர் ஹெட் ஸோ அது கம்ப்ளீட் பண்ணணும் அதுக்கப்புறம் ஸ்டூடெண்ட்ஸ் வாட் யூ ஹேவ் டு டூ யூ ஹேவ் டு மேக் ஷோர் தேட் யூ ஆர் ப்ராக்டிசிங் மாக் டெஸ்ட் இப்போ மாக் டெஸ்ட் இல்லைனா பார்ட் டெஸ்ட் அது எப்படி பேலன்ஸ் பண்ணுறது ட்யூரிங் திஸ் நவம்பர் டு ஜான் சீசன் இட் செல்ஃப் யூ கேன் ஸ்டார்ட் கிவிங் பார்ட் டெஸ்ட் பார்ட் டெஸ்ட்னா கம்ப்ளீட் பண்ண சாப்டர்ஸ் த பார்ட் டெஸ்ட் யூ ஹேவ் டு கிவ் ஸோ அது தானே பார்ட் டெஸ்ட் so adu complete panadukku appuram then once you complete the whole syllabus go for full test clear now students see whatever last year you did mistake you have to learn from that mistake if you are a student who is very weak in one of the subject give more focus to that subject this year that does not mean ignore the other subject 
keep a balance of it. But if you feel like I'm always weak in chemistry, I'm always weak in inorganic chemistry. आधे बंदे repeat आ revision पढ़ना students. So we are going to learn from last year mistake. Now you have completed your syllabus. Important chapters again. I'm telling you human physiology from your biology. Genetics very important. Evolution is very important. And as you go, you know all the chapters, right? Mechanics, optics. I've already made a video on 50 most important topics in physics which you're not supposed to skip. Make sure you watch that video as well. See. Now, how does your day goes, students? In the morning hour, please dedicate your time to making sure that you are going through one of your difficult subjects or your hardest subject. Why? Because your mind is going to be fresh. And after that, you can at least dedicate, let's say, five hours. At least you can dedicate for biology. Maybe two chapters you are completing. Big chapters. I'm telling unit wise, you can complete. And then physics, you can dedicate three hours. Chemistry, you can dedicate three hours. Where you are also doing mini mock test every day. In the mini mock test, lavan the minimum of ten questions. Yella uh, chapters you may edit it. You can do or fifty questions as a whole. You can do. After that, from first revision, chapter wise revision, March lavan the revisions you have to start. March and April is the most important time of your life where you do proper revision. And that time la vanda I will start studying na if you think students you are not going to be possible. So whatever mistake you did last year, try to correct that mistake. From this year have an error book because I know most of you do not have an error book last year. So this year please start the error book system so you know that I am always making mistake in this concept. I am doing silly mistake because of my overthinking. I am doing this mistake or some formulas I don't know. So that approach you have to do properly. Clear? Now, if this is clear, other than NCERT, PYQs, and completion of the syllabus, what are you supposed to do differently? Take last year your you know notes, short notes, or let's say anywhere where you have practiced everything. Go through that once and see. Maybe because students, every single year your way of studying will be a little more different. Some of you might be you know directly diving into NCERT. Some of you might be di directly diving into short notes. Some of you will be again focused on one shot, so it will vary. So I want you to go through your last year practice session books where you have practiced and see if there are any questions that you have still having a problem or you feel like oh my god this concept is still not clear in my head. I have to watch more videos. So other madri oru comparison pani you can continue your preparation. Now students see droppers. For other people, at least for the 11th standard, 12th standard students, droppers, one the always they are in benefit. Our one the only need focus. But Anna, the main problem for droppers or the main weak point for droppers is expectation and overthinking and going around the guilt loop. So that is why I am telling you, take this video as a warning. Please, I request all of you. Okay, I request all of you in the video or warning, my dear, to start today itself. Forget about what might happen because students, none of us can predict how the paper is going to be. If the paper is going to be easy, all the overthinking that you did today is going to come to a waste. Let's say if the paper is moderate, still you could have prepared better instead of overthinking and being in this guilt loop. And stop answering to your friends. Many of them casually or in a funny way might ask you again. You're taking a drop. Oh, seriously, why don't you do this with me? I'm already earning this much. Many people might tell you many things. If your goal is doctor. Then I am sorry. No one can tell you that do this or do that. You want to be a doctor. You have to be a doctor. That is a passion that you have led from a very young age. You can do it. But how you do it matters. How you become a better version of yourself from the last year matters. So please, students, all the droppers out there, you are not going to fail again, and you are never a failure just because you took a drop here. It is one more year of better learning, better understanding, and you also learn a lot of thing in this journey. So. Hats off to all of you for taking that one more step, taking that courage of taking one more year drop. But Anna, make sure that this one year does not go in waste. Do not waste your time. Do not be distracted. Stop going around loop of you know social media. Vanish yourself. You know disappear and make sure that you're coming back only after cracking. So students, if this video helped, quickly subscribe to We Need Tamil Nadu and. Every month, as a warning, I will come and write in front of you. So do subscribe to the channel because lot of amazing videos are planned for all of you. And this channel only exists to help you. So if you do not subscribe, then who else will subscribe? So stay subscribed. Share this video with all your friends who you think is suffering as well. And students, very importantly, Sunday and Saturday is your war day. Battlefield day. Those days is mock analysis plus mock. If you want test series, I have already given you a video where you are going to get test series, which has around three thousand six hundred plus questions, which are curated by all of us and the Ekalavya team. So if you are a student who is really looking for test series right now, it's at a very very affordable price. I will drop down the link in the description. You can check it out. Please practice test series. Please practice mock during the Saturday and Sunday. 
so thank you so much pasangala if you feel again the fear please drop it down in the comments what are you facing and i will try my level best to help you with whatever queries are there and i will also reply to all your comments so yes if this help video help quickly like the video and share it with your friend who are who is also suffering and do not forget to subscribe lot of content is coming on the channel beat one shots beat ncrt highlights so many things are planned for you so take maximum utilization of it and share it with every tamil nadu student out there bye bye see you all in the next video